Hello Capricorn, welcome to my channel. My name is Isabel from the tarotempress.com. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I'm going to be doing your tarot card reading and it's going to be focused on your love life. If you are new to my channel, welcome. As you can see, I've already shuffled the cards and laid them out. But before we begin, I'm going to be looking at the energy between you and the individual that you are dealing with. Okay, so I see that many of you are dealing with an individual that can be the type of individual that you've always wanted to have a relationship with. What is being highlighted about this person is the fact that they have certain components and characteristics that make you love them very much. I feel like this individual is the type of individual that has a very loving heart, a very giving heart. They're very soft-natured, you know, when it comes to their emotions. I feel like for some of you, the person you're dealing with wears their heart on their sleeve. And this is, just, you know, the element that could have uh, drawn you towards this individual. There's a sense of love. There's a sense of desire, compassion between each other. I feel like you understand them on a very deep level. In fact, I can feel the love that many of you have for this individual. Now, you see potential in this person. You see that they can be a wonderful life partner. They can be very devoted. They have all these amazing emotions inside of them that when they display it, it just makes you want to fall more deeply in love with them. I'm seeing that during this time, this individual is not really showing as much affection as they used to before. It feels as if this person might not be really expressing themselves in the way that they used to before, okay? Now, for those of you that might have been dealing with this individual for a long period of time or a short period of time, it doesn't really matter. But it feels as if, you know, this individual had a very beautiful way of communicating with you, a very soft-hearted kind way of relating to you that used to really you know make you uh, soften up and i'm sensing that there's been a change in how they interact and engage with you it feels as if something is blocking them from really folding their heart during this time and many of you could be feeling as if you know this potentially something going on in this individual's life for them to not be um, engaging with you in the way that they used to engage with you, right? I feel like they're not taking as many chances. They're not expressing themselves in that uh, beautiful emotional way as they used to. And this is definitely, you know, weighing very heavy on uh, many of you during this time. Now, I'm seeing here as well, there's this energy of where the relationship has become stuck. It feels like when it comes to this individual, there's an energy that is connecting to the fact that something is holding them back. Something is preventing them from breaking free out of whatever they're going through during this time. It feels as if there's a lot of grief here. There's a lot of worry. You might be aware of what is truly troubling this individual for some of you. For others, you might not know that this individual is going through a difficult time. I'm sensing that this is a connection that, um, you know, could have lost to the test of time. There's still a lot of passion here, but things have ended between the two of you. I'm sensing that there's a fear of uh, cheating, betrayal, deception, things of that nature. Some of you feel as if, you know, this individual was going out of their way to make you feel happy. They were, you know, embracing their emotions, treating you with a lot of love and respect, and then they became very quiet. And we see... The energy of uh, you know an ending that has occurred in the situation so i feel like this is a 
difficult for you to deal with because in the past, I feel like you might have been a little bit hesitant to truly embrace your emotions for this individual. It feels as if there was a part of you holding onto your heart very tightly. And then when all of that emotion was um, transformed, it feels as if you had this wild passion for this individual. And by that time, you know, when you fully invested yourself in this connection, it feels as if it ended, right? So many of you could be in the dark about why this really happened in the way that it did. Because the moment you open up your heart to this individual completely, right? And people can open up their hearts to individuals at different stages in a relationship. Some people can be in a relationship with a person for 10, 20 years. It doesn't matter, you know, to truly conquer the human spirit. It takes time with certain individuals. So it doesn't matter when you decided to open up your heart, especially if you've been in a long-term relationship with this individual or short-term relationship with this individual. People have different times that, uh, you know, they open up to love right so let's look at these other energies when i look at these cards which are reflecting your energy i get the impression that some of you have these emotions inside of you that have been bottled up you have these emotions that you don't know what you need to do with them during this time it feels as if it's you know overflowing and I feel like you're trying to make a decision about what to do with this individual concerned. Just because you don't know if they're fully invested in this relationship, whether they've gone you know, off and they're doing their own thing, are they going to come back? It feels as if you're trying to decide whether you should stick around or you should leave the situation. But I do feel like a lot of you are still very much connected to this individual in the sense of wanting and hoping for things to move forward right? I feel like there's this energy inside of you which is lending itself to wanting to compromise. But it also talks about the fact that some of you are feeling very restless during this time because this individual, you know, has uh, pulled away in a certain manner. And that could be weighing very heavily on your mind during this time. The energies that are connecting the two of you is uh, revolving mainly around your energy because we do have a card here which is indicating that this is leaning more on your side and it's talking about the fact that in regard to those memories, those experiences, those events that have shaped this connection between the two of you, many of you are unable to move beyond this. It's like you're living in the past and you're wanting for that energy to return, that feeling of falling in love that desire to reconnect with a human being on a very deep level where someone is actually interested in what you have to say, interested in what you think, you know, it's a wonderful feeling to go through. And I feel like many of you haven't had an easy time in terms of moving beyond that, just because those memories are so special to you. Those experiences are something that you have, uh, you know, kept inside of your heart, something that you feel very fondly towards. When I look at the energy of the individual you're dealing with, I feel like this person is in their own world, you know, literally in their own world where they can't snap out of this daze that they've found themselves in. It's like something has upset them or something has caused them to stagnate, where they can't see the love that you're presenting to them, where they can't truly take into account the connection, it feels like this individual is going through a difficult time right now. It might or might not have something to do with you. It might have to do with their own issues, but it feels as if this individual has went off into their own world. And for many of you, you're trying to reach this individual and your intrinsic nature, you know, the nature of the Capricorn is all about persistence, perseverance, working hard, making things work, finding a solution. That is your energy, you know. Capricorns never shy away from hard work and I feel like you see the situation with this individual and you want for that love to return. You want the person back, the person that you've fallen in love with, you know, because you have such a deep, deep connection to this individual. So I feel like during this time it's painful. It's very painful to see someone that you care about very deeply to go into this world where you can't reach them and you're trying and trying your very best and you know that deep inside there could be a little boy or a little girl in this individual that is going through a difficult time but they don't have the ability to reach out they don't have the ability to um, make this work right 
I'm seeing this energy of this individual dealing with some very harsh realities and not being able to cope with it in a way in which truly helps your union move forward, you know, truly helps progress in the situation. So this is a very disheartening time and these energies are coming to light. You know, it is the current energies during this time. It could be illuminating elements of their personality and character that they haven't fully dealt with, you know. So let's have a look. Get some clarification. For those of you that are interested in learning how to read tarot, you can check out the courses and books in the description box below. It is going to be an extended reading. So I'll be going into greater detail about the individual that you're dealing with. So we have cards popping out for the individual you're dealing with. It is in reverse. So far we have three cards in reverse. So I see that the individual you're dealing with is having a great deal of difficulty in the situation. There's something that has come to light or there's something that has happened for this individual that is making them feel deeply, deeply unhappy. It might have something to do with you. It might have something to do with their own personal issues, as I've mentioned before, because, you know, these cards are going to have to be further clarified. But I'm seeing here that there's this element of disappointment and sadness about something that happened here okay there's something concerning the element of the future the uncertainty of it it feels as if this individual that you're dealing with is you know going through something where they're either being troubled by something it feels as if they could be haunted by something and so the relationship with you is not making any progress because this is really affecting them on a deep level I'm seeing that for many of you, you know, you've been wanting to bring back this connection and it hasn't been easy because I feel like you've been looking for a new beginning and you've been wanting to move forward in this connection in a very passionate way. And some of you are afraid that the plans that you've been making haven't necessarily been bringing you the results that you've wanted. This individual has emotionally stalled in a very, very big way. So I'm going to be exploring the balance of these energies on an extended reading. You can find the link in the description box below. I hope you guys enjoyed your reading. Have a wonderful day and take care.